I'm not. I don't think my mechanics are good enough to do it on ADC. Just then you can't play Vayne. I don't want to hear it. Do you understand? There's a mindset yeah, thing. Everything I told you to do, you gave me some sort of like some sort of explanation as to why your your passive player. You use, basically you come up with pretty words that basically amount to I'm a I'm scared to try this. If you really like niece content and you really like niece stuff, I should say boot camps are the, the last boot camp is on September 12th. So I should be situated by then. On September 12th, we're doing one last boot camp. It's going to be the niece boot camp, the final one. We're going to have drills, awesome events, uh, an opportunity to maybe get a trip to Worlds, depending on how you perform during the boot camp, uh, whether you're an improved player, whether you're, you know, you're active in the community. And then we have the 1v1 tournament, uh, the $10,000 1v1 tournament that you will also be able to participate in as part of the event. I want to uh, rephrase the way that we're doing this boot camp, the Worlds giveaway. Um, it's not so much of a giveaway as it is a uh, an opportunity to engage with the content, engage with the coaches, uh, be a part of the community, be nice to one another, or just demonstrate that you've been practicing the drills. Um, and then we're going to be picking some people that we send to Worlds, okay? I, I want to make that clear. Uh, it's not about who's the most skilled or anything like that either. Again, thank you so much for being a nice supporter. Thanks for being a tryhard Trinomir, Giga Chad, Garen, and not a peeping Teemo, and hitting the follow buttons, the like buttons. And uh, yeah, the next time you see one of these big long streams will be in Korea. Peace! Check goal with the game. Um, I've been playing since like season two, um, and I've only hit like gold four over not, not those many years and i'm kind of tired of it Quiet. um so at this point you know i've i've done research i've looked at re replays all right i'm gonna be hard on you right away then so why the fuck is your champion pool all over the place yeah um the, the thing is i i get discouraged and i think mis of course mistakenly that you know maybe i need to go to maybe this champion will be better with this game but that's never the case yeah well you're fudging up all your your habits every time you yeah. do this um go ahead and queue up the first thing i'm going to tell you right away is that like you know if your goal is truly to get beyond your your plateau like you've got to have a more disciplined match history than this this looks like this looks like a mess there's let's see here shen shivana olaf yorick Siver, malphite jen twitch yumi yeah, it looks like it's all over the place. Yeah, um, there's no, there's no way that you're ever gonna like break new ground here unless you play like you're trying to go for a record. And going for a record basically means playing your best champion on repeat over and over again. May I ask why or why we're hung up on Vayne particularly? Um, she's the one I feel the most comfortable with. But results wise, is she the one that's giving you the best results? I think I think so. Um, if I, I don't if see I any evidence to support that. Uh, maybe in season seven. Mm, um, I'm just going off of the this. I'm just going off the what I see here. Yeah. Um. I I haven't looked too much into like the actual statistics and the results, but I if you look at the individual matches, I think I do okay. With that. I'm not gonna go out and say like I'm the best, you know, vein and silver, but. Well, what I'm. I need you to meet me in reality, right? If I go to your match history right now, right? Vayne's sitting at 49% win rate over 43 games. You've got Sivir, which is six, sitting at 61% win rate. You've got Ash is sitting at a positive win rate. You've got Ziggs is sitting at a really good win rate. Heimerdinger is sitting at a really good win rate. Jin sitting at a shit win rate because Jin sucks anyways. But like, if I were to go through this, I would just be like, what the fuck are we playing Vayne for? Um... Like it, Honestly, just off of honestly. off of pure off of pure, just again what I see. Right, there might be secrets or little details here that I don't really that I'm not getting entirely. But like yeah. it just looks like purely off of data that if you're on vain, nothing that impressive is happening. No offense. No, no, no. You're you're absolutely right. Um, yes, I, I like Sever, and uh, there's I don't, I, I'm just comfortable with vain at a certain point. Like, that's my fallback character, but um, I'm not dead set. I put Vayne and Ash just because those yeah. are the ones that I'm most I, familiar with. I see. So, basically, what I would do, if I were you, whatever the hell you're going to stick with, you need to pick two of them. And from now on, any role that you get, 
that's a different role. You pick yeah. one champion per role, period. Okay. Right? That's none of this fucking, oh, I play whatever I feel like. Yeah. Because when you message me in two weeks after this coaching, right? And I say, how's it going? If your match history is still jacked up like this, I'm just going to be like, did you even learn anything? Right? Did you even try? Because it's it's like going on a di it's like a diet, right? Yeah. Like if I if I if I say, hey, I'm gonna get fucking if I'm gonna get sick abs, right? I'm gonna have to dial in the snack food and the carbs and and make sure to get get my runs in, right? I'm gonna have to do all these yeah. things. I can't go back two weeks later to the trainer and be like, hey, by the way, like I know I said I was gonna like drop weight, but like. I really like Oreos, and um, I get discouraged when I don't get to eat Oreos. Uh, this invade, invade is not it. I would it's, not. Yeah. I would ping it off. I'd ping it off and leave. It's an int. It's an int. I would never. Do you want? Do you want me to commit to the strategy? Or if if Urgot's there, I will. If Urgot's there, I will. Otherwise, I'm not doing it. I think I think he's going up. Yeah. If Urgot leads it, it's actually not that bad. But like everybody else, like Ivern, Cassiopeia. So well, basically, if they happen to have like, I don't know, three of the five there, you guys would still lose. Yeah. I'm going to just stay in this position. Um, even though I see, uh, I think Swin's a... Oh. oh. So it's a Swain ADC and a Shen. You're allowed to get some autos here, uh, since they used everything. Yeah. You do hard win early, but you gotta get autos the whole time. I'm a little nervous, so I'll, I'll be a little jittery at first. Oh, don't be nervous. We're about to get level two. Now's not the time to be nervous. I got you. Uh, two melees, we're gonna go in. So assist ping like you wanna go in, like spam ping it and walk up. Walk up confident. You do win, but you need to walk up. You win this. If you keep autoing Shen, you should be okay, even though I know he's like tanky, but I would keep autoing him. Get ready to flash after him. You're gonna have to. Yeah. Q. Yes. Good job. Kite away, yeah. You gotta you gotta live here on this wave, otherwise we're staying. Like I'm not leaving. Yeah. Wave's too big. Well, Ours, ours is pushing. Do you want me to just... Yeah, push just keep pushing, thing? keep pushing, and just get ready to sidestep the uh, Q. He's going to try to Q you. Okay, you got a Zach. Oh, damn. So, <clears throat> I, th there's a couple... Th I'm going to write it down, actually. All right. I'll just go over it after. I'd want to see what's happening in that mid with that gank. I'd want to know the outcome. Huh. So it looks like Zap's. Uh, we could go all in here on the three. Yeah, start uh, pinging on the way and run up. Yeah. Okay, he left us. All right, now. You can pink try here because you are pushing. Uh, I would have been try. I don't think you can ever defend that thing. Mm. Oh, okay. I got you. Yeah. It's pretty hard to defend. Do you want me to hard push this? No, slow, slow. There's no point. Nothing changes. Okay. He's just gonna... So yeah, I think you're this. technically... I, I think you're technically giving him more XP by pushing fast here. That's true, that's true. I just thought since he went B. Yeah. Zach is top, so I'm fishing for a play. So p poke your nose forward and try to play off Ivern grab, like ping on the way. Very important that you, uh, well, he just used his Q, so it won't work, but it's very important that you communicate that you want to fight as an AD carry. So like right now, I want to fight, so ping on the way. And like target ping and stuff. Like really try to like convince your teammate that you want to hit some damage. 
I'm just, just while just while you're allowed to, right? Yeah. Uh, just because I think Iron's just not that strong. Oh, it doesn't matter. You're vain, and there's two guys that you can just destroy and sustain combat. True. If you were facing like a Draven, I'd agree with you. Yeah, I got you. Um. Yeah, just keep autoing. Keep pushing the wave. We're gonna shove this next wave. This guy is like dead here, I think. So it's fine. All right, just shove the at least shove the melees. Keep autoing though. You have a window here where you're allowed to auto, but you gotta keep it up. Yep, keep autoing. Fast you auto. Okay. Walk up and try to. All right. They're pushing okay. into you. It's fine. Let it push to you. It's fine. They're shoving cool, hard. Cool. That's good for us. At least we'll get the XP. Zach's coming yeah, down Zach's anyways. Here. I think he's coming for the drag. Um, should I collide? You, can, you could, but the thing is, it depends on your team. Let's watch the fight and like, we're not very strong. We also, if we, we cannot die. Whatever happens, we can't die. Okay. Because the wave's too oh, big down here. Man. Okay. Um, I'm thinking I'll thin the wave and then let it push into me. Yep. Get rid of one more melee and chill right there. Yep. yep. Don't auto anymore. All right. Okay. Okay, back. Do I stay for this? Mm, I would just focus minions. I'd focus minions, man. All right. That's what I'm going to do. Too scary. You have a heal, though. Don't forget. Oh, I might did. I might did here. Yeah. That's my bad. I ran into that. So, already. I mean, the bigger issue is just getting hit by a Zach jump. Getting hit by a Zach jump is vain is, is almost illegal. It's borderline illegal. I got you. Let them take drag. Yeah, no, there's no stopping it. Yeah. Thanks for the stars, guys. I have tried the eye tracker before, but it's too much of a pain to set up. Yeah, we got to get there now. Yep, yeah, keep bottling. You need to ult now. For Zach, for Zach, for Zach. All right, I'm moving up. All right. All right, back to bottom. Oh, never mind. Holy oh, shit! What's with the fucking sh with the star spam? No, I'm going back to bottom. Ping that off. Ping that off. Shove the wave first, at least. All right. Thanks, Devin. Appreciate it. I don't know why I haven't seen what to do for this. Should I go? Be Jesus right. Christ. Devin, thank you. <laughs> Luis, thanks, man. You guys are going in. So why did it take us so long to ult in that fight? What was going on there? Oh, um, I didn't know I leveled up. Just awareness. Mm. Um, but if I had, uh, I, I, I guess I do hold back. Um, on certain things when I don't know the specific outcome. Could be fear. <laughs> Could be fear, yeah. <laughs> That's slow push here. Right. You have red buff, you can run people down a long lane.
Hmm. All right, you have ult? I yeah, I think so. I'd play it out. You don't get bursted, but you get to kite out the swain, yeah? I'm gonna focus the swain. Oh, yeah, I, I, I need to, I really need to work on like when a lot of shit's going on to be able to kind of single out where I am. Hmm. I'm gonna write that fight down too. All right. Thanks, Dev. Appreciate it. I go to I'm getting star to spammed. <clears throat> yeah, we can rotate. Okay. Hold tab, check his items. The fuck is this guy in our jungle killing my my junglers? What I'd be thinking here. The only reason we're rotating is for the hope of doubles. Looks like Cassio Pia. Oh, maybe. Nice, cool. All right, let's go back to bottom. We have enough money for shield bow. We gotta clear the wave first before we can reset. I think they took the. Oh, they're not. Now, why did we rotate? Okay, so that was an interesting rotation. And why did we rotate so wide there? Um, no. What were we were uh, afraid of. You have red buff, double buffs. You have ult, you have flash, you have heal, you have Ivern next to you. You're right, you're right. Yeah. If he ease me right here, I'm gonna. Yeah, I think you can probably go, yeah. I, yeah, I yeah, that's fine. More. Keep poking at him. Keep poking at him. Yeah, just get away from it. Yeah, just get away from it. <clears throat> oh my god. Yeah, you probably have to flash out. You have to treat mm -hmm. that thing just like... Basically, it's survival. I think the problem with the going in here, and I think it was fine to try it, but the problem really just lies in the fact that we have shield bow already. So you probably should mm -hmm. wait. What is this guy doing? Okay. All right, back to top. I think. What, I mean, I'm not going to bottom here. I would take wolves. I'd take romp. I'd grab top. Sounds good. And I'd be using my Q too. <clears throat> oh, whoops. not that way though. <laughs> yeah. Should always with Vayne be queuing right against the wall when farming. It's a shorter cooldown, like stick your nose against the wall when you queue. Mm. I didn't know that. It's faster auto attacks. Even closer than that. Okay. It's the same thing when you're sieging towers or objectives, you can use that quick Q as the way to do higher damage. Oh, okay, I see what you mean. I'd push hard. It's a Maokai. I'm going to challenge him all day. All right. I don't know why Urgot went to bottom, but I'm going to take that free solo farm, you know? Mm, yeah, yeah, for sure. I put a pink below me here, so, so I have time to react. Yep, auto, auto, auto. Okay, go to red, go to red, 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 red. His red, his red. 
Going near Maokai under tower is like never the answer. That shit like yeah. never works. Okay. I would just get away from that guy. Sounds good. You can farm mid safely. Mm -hmm. Just kite back. Um, should I rotate over mm, here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, we got to keep your camera on it, though. We have no ult, so it's not pretty. Yep. Um, I think... She's doing pretty well. It's a good kite scenario for her. Scared of the swing damage. Should be autoing, yeah, the minions the whole time. Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. They're very so low. Bottom, they're very, yeah, they're very low. We could definitely come in on a flank too. Keep your cam, like, keep darting your camera over. You might have to help them. Now you can walk over. Now you walk over. All right, I'm, okay. Just kick him out. Okay. Ha! Huh! That's a funny condemn. All right, cool. Let's go to bottom. Uh, go to bottom. Swain's dead. Zach just jumped out, flashed out. Um, I don't know where Yasuo or. Okay. Now leave. Now leave. Now leave. All right. Do a challenge? Yeah, I would eat him and just... Yeah. Uh, I think I'm dead. Gotta dodge it, you're an ADC. It's a max range tornado. Gotta dodge. Okay. I, I guess I could ju I just kind of tunnel vision into running straight away from him. Yeah, that's, that's not good. <laughs> the that's not good. You, oh, you have nothing else to do but think about what's coming for you when you're running straight. Yeah. Right? It's no, it does no good to just give up on the play mentally, mechanically. Mm -hmm. If you're going to flash, you better be planning on dodging some shit. Otherwise, there's no point of flashing. Might as well just die at that point. Mm -hmm. um, bot waves. Kind of yeah, I think I would go... Uh, I mean, I'm always down with working side lanes. But... It really depends. Like there, when I say work bottom like that, you're you're playing cat and mouse. So like, as soon as you clear those minions, you should immediately like tumble away. If Yasuo shows up, you EM. Like you got to be a much more responsive player than that if you're gonna side lane. Okay. It's a lot of like you're pushing right up to the line of getting caught, and you have to be ready to to peace out as soon as you see somebody. Okay. I think rather than doing that, I just don't go there at all. But yeah, I, I can see where that that's where I need to take the next step. Well, well, the thing is, is not going there at all is bad because you're not learning limits. For sure, for sure. I, I, I am a very safe player. Wow, your team is just death balling here. So we need to assist ping Baron off of this. We're vain with the Cassiopeia. Assist ping it a bunch. Doesn't matter. You would go for it. They have no jungler. If Swain comes down, you're just gonna bail. If he if he makes a good stand, you guys have like a shit ton of damage though. This is good. Still good. Okay, condemn. Oh my god, they steal it. It's disgusting. Cut out, just cut out. Q way. You got a plant. Nice. Press B. Does this Warwick have smite or what? <clears throat> There's no jungler on the other team. I assume he did. Woo! Tuh.
Nice. Oh. Almost, almost clean. Well, the Baron call is correct. It's just unfortunate that uh, Jungler misses it. It's the right call, though. Because their Zac is dead, right? I don't think we lose the game yet, thankfully. I used to be a lot more of a... Like, I, I, I like to enjoy those kind of, like... Um, plays, but uh, I don't know. I, maybe it's because I don't utilize like mute all that I stop making those plays. Why? What does it matter? That's true. I just go to top. I mean, muting all is good, but what? What is it? Uh, like it's the right. There's the right plays and wrong plays. Like it doesn't matter what people say. Yeah. Right. Like the the guys is too dead. Your vein Cassiopeia. With, by the way, they're not supposed to be able to come over the Baron Pit. You have a Cassiopeia, he can just W over the wall. You understand? Like, there's no, it's it's a good play. There's nothing that they're supposed to be able to do about it. Yeah. Or if they walk in, she just Ws when they walk in. Like, mm -hmm. it's a really good objective control. Just keep pushing. Why is it that, um, so I'm just curious, why is it that we're pushing top rather than going for dragon? Right now, it's because we were trying to catch it. Well, not necessarily catch up, but we're trying to stay ahead and farm. Hold tab. There's also no real guarantee that you can actually even get the dragon in that situation because we got to push all the way out of base. Enemy team still has Baron. So I would push this wave with the intent to run away. I could see Swain. So it's Zach and Shen right now is what we're worried about. Yasuo. Oh, Yasuo's dead, dude. Now go to golems. That's what. You, that's why you got to be pushing, yeah. True, 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 true. Take golems. Kite back. No! You're not afraid. Kite, kite, come on. Like hit him. Hit him. Now out of the yeah, out of the golems. Like your vein, it's a Zach. Like we're not afraid of him ever. Okay. Like if we're not, if we're, if we're afraid to kite this type of champion, like why are we playing vein? Right. Let's go up and grab this wave. We want to get our item up. We really want that wit's end. I, that's what you're going for, right? That's a good buy by you. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah that's a good uh, buy. For the Swain. Yeah, that's a good buy. It's not just a Swain. It's good across the board. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The only person that's not good into is Yasuo, but we don't really... Can't hit him anyways. Should I kind of back up? I'm yeah, hover. Hover. It's a hover. Yeah, that's really good. Uh... Go poke um, at him. Go poke at him. It's, it, his whole team's bottom. Yeah, push. Try to get him to fight you or something. Right, now his team might be coming for you, maybe, but it'll take him time. I don't know. Three bottom. I think I'm pushing into this. I think there's another... Get ready to queue. Permanent. Yeah, get ready to queue. There you go. Oh. It's fine. Auto. You win this, but you need to ult. Oh, my God. Oh, it's so <laughs> ugly. Part, part of that wasn't button mashing. I, I will admit. Why <laughs> button mash? You have shield bow. Um, I think initially it was just the late time reaction. Oh, it didn't proc either. You were yeah, right. yeah. Oh, I know. I'm playing too scared. You, yeah, you've been you giving me a lot of excuses why things are scary instead of why we win, and it's uh, it's a defeatist no, yeah, mentality. Sure. Keep pushing. Keep pushing now. Keep pushing now. The guy, right. look at the map, dude. It's the same fucking fight. Nothing changed. Look. I got you. It's the same guy. You're right, you're right. Now we go to red. We're going to red. Okay, press B. It's good enough. <clears throat> we got our item. And then I... I feel like Bork is actually good here. Ah, uh, because of all the... Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, grab and go. Grab and go. What you can. Alright, let's go. You out there. I know it sucks, but a little bit it could be the it could be a difference between an auto attack and no auto attack, right? For sure, for sure. We're going there, yeah. We're definitely going there. He's out of mana. Like this is free. Keep chasing. Okay, you're fine. Keep on cruising. You might bump into not, Yasuo. Not nah, I wouldn't. I would just push. Maokai's not gonna end. I don't give a shit. And your team's already backing. Like, you have to know when your team's already handling problems. It's, you don't overkill the same problem. True, 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 true. Um, you You're pushing one more wave, and then... 
Yeah, you reach, you get this uh, this wave. Okay. Be ready to jump because you've got Zach on you again, probably soon. Okay, Zach's at top, so you're gonna auto and, and kite and just be confident. Be confident, and then hit tower. There you go. Yep. Keep limit testing it. I don't give a shit. Now go to Gromp. Go to Gromp. Up to the left. Why are we going to Narnia? Thank you. I got you. I got you. I need you to move quick. I need you to get all this shit and pressure properly. Yep. Now go back to the go back to the tower. Go. Where are you going? Uh um, for the here or here? It, I, w I want you to be fast. All right, I, got I don't you. want you going down and around like you taking a stroll. You could outplay this depending on your kiting. Mm, maybe Which dead. Is bad. <laughs> Keep autoing and moving. Oh, okay, it's fine. Yeah, it's I fine. Your team gets Varen off it. I think. Assuming that Cassiopeia has the damage, she does. But she's not there. Uh, well, how the fuck are we doing it? Uh, I guess it's Urgot. What is that? Urgot? Ivern and Warwick. They seem pretty fast, actually. Orc. I enjoy... I enjoy... I, I like split pushing a lot, which is why I like, um... Top, but I'm not... I don't think my mechanics are good enough to do it on ADC. Just then you can't fucking song. play Vayne. I don't want to hear it. All right, I got you. Then you understand? There's a mindset yeah, thing, that's why, been, that's why I play um Sivir, because she does the waves. I can move the waves to my advantage a lot easier. Because if that's if that's literally how you feel, right, that means mm -hmm. this play style is not it. I got you. Right, that's on you. I mean, that's however you want to choose. No, I'm not like, you know, I'm not like, oh, I'll go play Verna or I'll, you know, I'll go yeah. League of Legends. It's just, <laughs> you know, whatever. Grab, whatever grab red, grab red me. first. All right, I got you. Now we're going to go to mid and fight this Yasuo, which is... A, well, sorry, you're not going to fight him. What you're going to do is you're going to re receive sure the wave. Okay. Go go safely. Don't go near him. Just go around him. Go around him. Go around him. Oh, God. Going around. Going around. Yeah, just clear the wave as you move. Yep. There you go. And just dodge tornado. Don't be silly here and get caught up. Good. Easy. See? Easy game. Oh no! <laughs> that, that's my bad. I, I don't I, see I, I no. I, I see no condemn either. Oh yeah. You're right. I think you just lost the game with that. Interesting. Mm, okay. Interesting time. Maybe uh, Ivan holds. I don't know. We'll see. I don't. I think the game's over though. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh. Huh? We didn't lose yet. Yeah, GA is fine. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna farm a wave and save up for this, or just grab whatever. I would just grab the cloth for now. All right. A ward over the wall. Ooh, that's a big catch. He can't move. Keep going. Mm, yeah, I mean you gotta you gotta kite it out though. This is crazy. Should have gone a little farther away. <clears throat> mm. Oh no, I'm seeing a lot of failed skill checks here. Okay. Yeah, that's cool with me, dude. That's what I want to know. It's just a lot of... Because when I look at myself, I'm like, oh, I'm not that bad. But that's when I need somebody who's like, actually, who knows what they're talking about. to be like, no, dude, you're shit. <laughs> I don't think you're shit. I just think you lack confidence. Okay. Everything I told you to do, you gave me some sort of like 
some sort of explanation as to why you're your passive player you use basically you come up with pretty words I'll wait till you're out of this and you can still hear me yeah i can hear you okay good basically you come up with pretty words that basically amount to and i'm sorry i'm just being honest because you paid me that basically amount to i'm a bitch i'm scared to try this or i'm scared that uh i'm basically scared to fail like you say i don't want to push bot because i don't want to split because i don't have the mechanics well i mean i said you shouldn't play vein then i just mean in general you shouldn't play adc to be honest then the next thing i said is like oh you should pressure zach like you saw zach you ran away from him even though like up top you're an adc you're vain you have q you could dodge the majority of his shit, and you're good into tanks you kind of played scared into that then at one point i said uh there's something else in there too it was it was, was basically was it a, yeah go ahead was it pathing around yeah it's like a lot of pathing it's a lot of soft pathing that's part of it too i didn't even think about that actually the soft pathing when you have like hard angles that you could take um it's basically just a constant like i don't want to limit test for some reason and then you normally come up with like some rationale it's like well i'm a passive player or oh oh it was the baron that's what it was it was like oh i like doing these calls but then people like get mad or ping me or whatever it just seems like a bunch of excuses for i don't want to limit test because i don't want to fail and look bad but like that's kind of a requirement for your role i got you you peel layers back and recognize when you can like actually make a stand in dps and then you dps so for example i will share my screen and show you exactly what i mean okay hold on one second also i really don't mind man say it how it is no no it's fine yeah i, I think i i think i did i think i said everything oh yeah yeah i'm not trying to bash you i'm not i'm just trying no, to be no, honest no. with you so that you know like where, where i think you stand and then hopefully no this is whatever adjustments I'm, I'm you need to make i'm really excited this is really i'm i'm like the, um i don't know how to explain it i'm, I'm really excited to learn. my my whole thing is like, let me give you an example of the Zack fight, okay? This is like an example. Yeah. You can, you, you're close, like it's mechanically close, but you're getting in your own head, I think. Like, mm. if you, let me find this fight, because it was a fight at top side, I want to say. You were pushing top. I don't know when it was. I think it was a little after. I think it was after first Baron. that point i think i had you split mm -hmm. now yeah, watch I, I, you see my screen yes yeah okay. okay when we side lane <clears throat> we hold tab from time to time and check death timers or just see death timers on our screen mm -hmm. we're playing a game we're cross-referencing is all we're doing okay we're just saying you know how many people can possibly defend me right now it's all we're doing okay so in the instance of this what we're saying is right now maokai's dead yasuo's dead all right so what am i doing here i'm going swain's mid swain disappears i say okay cool we back up swain shows up first thing you go is Ooh, you said ooh, like you're scared of him what are we scared of him for uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, really? The only person that could be there, I mean, maybe if Shen's here too, but that's okay. Yeah. All right, that's all right. I mean, I'm going to auto him and poke at him a little bit and see what he does. Right? That's a tank. That's a Swain. Swain can't do shit from there. Yeah. The point is, is you got to find lines. You got to find excuses for why you win, not constant reasons why you lose. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah, sure. it's easy to find excuses why you lose it's easy to say oh uh i'm gonna misplay this oh this guy's there's two people here i'm scared Oop. but like it's hard to go wait do i win here yeah right that's hard to do so here with two dead and a tank and the guy that can't touch you and another tank i'm gonna poke at them mm -hmm. I've got sums up. I've got everything. I'm going to poke. I'm going to auto them confidently and see if I can get them to rage force a fight on me or something. Yeah. Um, but you didn't, right? We, we backed up. It's fine. 
even when you dodged, you were scared of him, which is wild to me, because I would have autoed him that whole time. Mm -hmm. In fact, when I saw this, if I was playing Vayne here, I don't consider myself the Vayne B's knees or anything, but if I was top right now, and I saw this, if I dodged like this, I would have actually just ulted. Mm -hmm. it's we're, an the opportunity. we're the same level. Yeah. He's got fucking Mobies, dude. I don't know why. <laughs> Raves under tower. Your team's pushing. Two are dead. Why the fuck not? He can't kill me. The only thing that can happen is a Shen ults or something. But, I mean, that's fine. I'll just flash away. If I have to. That's my logic. Right? So you run away. And then you finally auto him. Oh, wait. No, we cleared this first. So now we gave him a chance. Now, the map. Enemies have respawned now. So we missed the window. Now we push up, and you keep trying to back down. I like the hover, actually. The hover's correct. Then I see Swain, Shen, and Yasuo. So guess what I'm thinking? Same thing. I'm going to poke at this. And I tell you to push up. Then you get the fight you want. You play it right. You flash, which was good. And then you fight it out. Don't know what you're eating for. Because again, you have shield bow. He hasn't yeah, even popped yeah, yeah. yet. No, you're right, you're right. We get tower. We win the exchange. But not really. We didn't crush it, right? And this is what I'm talking no. about. Is like we're just not crushing the scenarios where we should be. Um mm -hmm. let's see, gank misplay 245. I think this is where you, um, you said push up. Yeah, I wanted you to push. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then I, I think I ran into the... Uh, I got hit by the back. You're just it's not queuing weird. forever, which is very weird. Should queue right here as soon as you step out of the bush. Okay. This was weird by you. Okay. Um, 11. I don't know if you get out of that all the time, but you should have there. Mm -hmm. And then I walk back into the, the okay. spacing looks weird. If I were if I were kiting as an ADC here, I don't think I would be kiting like down here ever. Mm -hmm. This is a similar thing I told the last guy today, which is like I'm kiting this way. Okay. Look at how you keep trying to cheat down for some reason. It's very strange. You keep going under it. Why not like auto and just move back? Why not front to back? Mm -hmm. You see how you keep like cheating to the bottom? It doesn't make a lot of sense. Watch, you're gonna do it again. Yeah, yeah. It should always be. You see the difference? Mm -hmm. You should always be. You just do the same exact movements except pull it into your fountain. Okay. Because you, you for some reason, you keep going in here when you're moving. It just isn't. It's. I always say it's 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 like two magnets, right? Mm hmm. You've got two positive ends on a magnet, right? You can't stick them together, can you? No. Exactly, right? They repel. It's the same thing here. Don't go in. Don't try to get all close, right? Repel it like that in a straight line. So your autos and your movement should be deliberate this way. Never down unless, of course, you're... I mean, if your team's winning, I guess, but... Yeah. This is a very close fight. I'm not, I'm not going in there and putting all the chips in and hoping that I win. I got you. Got it. Mm -hmm. Now, champs, champs, your call. I mean, really, man, you you know your mechanics aren't that bad, but what is bad is your confidence. Okay. That you you just you lack confidence, and that's something that, uh, I mean, from now on, as soon as I said, hey, your mechanics might not be good enough. No, I didn't even say that. 
I just said, I, I, I didn't. You said it yourself. As soon yeah, as I told I did, you to split push, you started doubting your own mechanics and say, oh, I just don't have the mechanics to do this play style. And I'm just like, okay, maybe, right? Maybe you don't. I don't know. But the thing is, is that like, that's never been a thought in my head when I play this game. To make myself sound like a douche. I never, I never lose a fight and think, wow, I, I'll never be good mechanically. My brain is just like, you know, oh, I played, I, I positioned wrong, or I, I didn't see like that shield bow incident at top. That has nothing to do with mechanics. That's the thing. My head doesn't, I, I know it's, it's confidence, but it's also game knowledge. Mm -hmm. I'm going to fight like the most cocky motherfucker until he breaks my shield bow. And then only then might I think about doing something different. Mm, okay. If you compartmentalize it like that, it's a lot easier to play out the fight. The problem is you're shitting yourself, like throwing E. But like in my head, I'm just like, well, we have shield bow, so I'm just gonna wait. Okay. It's the fact that you didn't frame it up like that before fighting is the problem. Okay. Right? Imagine if you had told yourself going into that fight, like, I'm just gonna auto him until I see shield bow pop, and then I'll do something. All right. right? Yeah, I can totally see that. Because the reason you're throwing your E out like a psychopath is mm -hmm. because you're scared that you're going to die. But that means that you didn't think that you had shield bow. Like you forgot or something. Mm -hmm. Right? That's a bigger problem. That's not a mechanical problem. That's a confidence. Yeah, that's a game. Not, like not even confidence. It's not even confidence. It's awareness. Mm -hmm. Right? It's saying, I am test... You also, I guess it kind of is a confidence thing because... I test to lines, right? I, I was just playing Garen earlier today, right? Mm -hmm. and, and one of the things I did was I, I play, I'm playing proxy Garen. And I int all the time because I'm trying to like come up with a cool way to play Garen differently, right? And just fuck around with it. Dude, mm -hmm. I int all the time. And I say, and say, oh, I guess I can't do that. Right? I guess I'm not allowed to do that. Or I thought I could get away with that, but I guess I can't. Or I thought I could use this and this and get away. Like, that's how you should view the game. 